Well, you make up a good point because people, you know, they, they're not going to give you any money unless they trust you for totally, it. Totally. That's, you know, that's how you gain their trust. I mean, you're yeah. open and honest with them. How many deals have you done? None. How many experiences do you have? None. Yeah. You know, but yet, you told them, I'm sure you told them about your team and you did all the right yes. things. But, totally. but they looked into your eyes and saw that you were sincere. Yeah. You know, and they're thinking, you know, the, the, the question that every investor has before they invest when you're giving a pitch like that is, can this person give me my money back? Yes. They're not even, they don't even care about what the return's going to be. The no. first question is, are they going to give me, it's, will he give me my money back? Yeah. Right? Or can he give me my money back? Preservation of capital. You're so right. I mean, they're worried. If I give you 100, would I get it back in five years? You're promising me. And then, of course, you know, uh, interest or the cash flows and all and the waterfalls, you know, they come later, but you're so right about it, you know, and how sincere you are, what kind of communication you're going to have with them. Would you take care of them when they need and would you be transparent in showing all the books and everything? Yes, yes. Yeah, absolutely. So um, in that particular deal, so it was challenging because you hadn't raised any funds yet. But was it, what else was it? What, how many units was this deal? It was 109 units, by the way, and also 101 storage units on the same 2.33 acres of land. Wow. We bought it for 2.4. We sold it for 5 million. Pretty how good much return. Was, how much was the raise on that deal? Uh, 1.150. Uh, 1, so 1 million was the down payment. And yeah. then 115,000 was the closing cost, small oh, okay. acquisition fee, things like that, right? And this was the guy that you got the- um, Seller financing, from. seller okay, financing. So you required to, so he saw that you were green and he wanted more money down to ensure that when yeah. you foreclosed on you, that- uh, Totally. It's gonna, gonna be a good shape. Yes. All right, so you had to raise a million. The one, you, the, the gentleman you just talked about, that gate wrote you a check, okay? He was, he's one, I don't, how much did he go in for, do you remember? He gave me first, he says, Vinny, I'm gonna give 50,000, literally. He wrote me a yeah. check. I said, no, 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 don't write me a check yet because I have learned from you that, you know, we gotta get the legal paperwork going, PPM oh, yeah, right. going, all that, right? And have a checking account set up, never co-mingle any funds whatsoever. I've never done that. I've done 35 syndications. Every single thing is separate and all. And, uh, you know, so he actually, I kept in touch with him and other people. He increased the amount to 125,000. He says, Vinny, thanks for sharing with me with all the due diligence process and everything.